morning, everybody. This is Arvin Lewis on the Arvin Lewis Radio Show. My very special guest is Mr. Al Stahaley, all the way out here from Houston, Texas, doing some shows in California. And we'll be playing on Friday, uh, September 1st at Lost Score Guitars and Solving with Walk the Whale. Come check us out for a cool songwriter night. And Al, I thought we could just finish up by talking about um, I mean, we're discussing your most recent album somewhere in West Texas, uh, but let's talk about, you know, like for 20 years, you didn't have a solo career because you were busy raising your family and everything. Um, and then you revived it. So what inspired you to just get out there again and keep performing? Well, I'll tell you, uh, your friend and mine, Freddie Steady Kirch, who I think has already been on your show. Uh, I met Freddie back in uh when I was still living in LA and he was playing with B.W. Stevenson. Uh, and I, at the time I didn't have a record deal and he came out and, uh, well, actually, no, no, he, he reminded me, we met when I was playing bass with Chris Hillman and we did uh, a show together, uh, a festival in Texas, but then he came out to LA, came over to my house. He heard these songs I had and he said, Oh man, I want, I want to move to LA and, and play in your band. I said, Freddie, you don't want to do that. I can't let you do that because right now uh, I've got, although I have good guys playing with me, when we do play, we make about 30 bucks a piece. That sounds like Los Angeles. <laughs> you know? I said, yeah. I'm not going to let you move from a good, uh, Texas for this good gig. Well, luckily I didn't because he got, his next gig was playing with Jerry Jeff Walker and it lasted about eight years, I think. So, <laughs> Uh, so maybe he thought he owed me one <laughs> uh, uh, after, uh, well, and the reason I uh, I quit uh, playing for a while was uh, my son was born in 85. I thought, I'm doing some cool things in music, but I'm also doing this law thing. I better bear down on this law thing because the music isn't paying the bills. And uh, so I didn't really go out and perform except once in a while I'll sit in with people. Uh, but then, you know, and, and the career built up, like you mentioned earlier, I represent Steve Ray Vaughn. I started building up the entertainment law practice, but at one point, uh, Freddie, I guess it's quite a while ago now, uh, Freddie calls said, Hey, uh, we know my band knows a few years on. Why don't you come to Austin and be a special guest and sit in and do three or four years songs. I'm like, well, okay. That sounds like fun. He said, Hey, let's, uh, let's go over to Thread Guilds and do a song swap. Me and Cam King, or why don't you join it? Well, okay, that's easy enough. Sit around, acoustic guitar, play some songs. He said, you know that album you had out in, uh, in Europe on Polydor uh, back in the 80s? You own that, don't you? I said, yeah, it's license is over. He said, you know, it's never been out in the U.S. Why don't you let me release it on Steady Boy Records? Nice. I said, oh, well, okay. So he puts the album out, and then he called and said, he said, you know, you got an album out. You got to play some gigs. <laughs> no, so so I don't know if any, yeah, he said, pull me in. He, yeah. So really, I would not be here talking to you and would not have had uh, this album out or been playing gigs for the last 15 years if Freddie hadn't pulled me back in. And, uh, and now, you know, he's uh, nice enough and, generous enough to come play drums with me live when he what doesn't really drummer. have to he's got so so many things to do the last thing he needs to be doing is playing with me but he does wow. it and i appreciate it well it's been so much fun getting to hear all your stories today al thank you so much for coming mm -hmm. on the show um sadly we're out of time so everybody stay tuned for uh the second round of the alista haley show so, um and uh <laughs> um anyway you're listening to arwin lewis on the arwin lewis radio show my very special guest has been alista haley we're playing songs from his record somewhere in west texas that's just recently been released um and we're going to um play in its entirety his song something good is going to happen that's uh off of his LP that we're talking about. And you can find out more about Al Stahaley at alstahaley.com. A-L-S-T-A-E-H-E-L-Y.com. May I just say that uh, it's also on Quarto Valley Records. Let me give Quarto Valley oh, yeah. Records a plug. They uh, won a Grammy last year on the Edgar Winter Brother Johnny album. And so I think I need to mention them. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, oh, and you know what? Your album's coming next. Thank you all so much for listening. Thank you all for coming on the show today. Oh, thank you so very much. All right, everybody have a good morning.
Great. All right, we're clear. Yay. Oh, no, you like didn't. That. No, you didn't. Because yeah. I'll delete you. You know I'll delete you. <laughs> <laughs> now, that's fun. Mind, Thank you. Reading Jeremiah 